And on top of our news tonight, the police in Accra have begun a 24-hour surveillance at English Amamfro in the Gasal municipality following the spirit of armed robbery in the community. Meanwhile, a couple has vacated their dressmaking shop to be used as a police post. Residents of English Amamfro and its environs have been hit by a spate of armed robbery over the last few weeks. The robbers have taken advantage of the absence of a police station and the deplorable roads to perpetuate their criminal activities. There have been four reported incidents within three days after the police led by the regional commander visited last week. The development has prompted the police to establish a 24-hour tent city police post to enhance surveillance in the area pending the completion of two police stations initiated by the resident associations. So we are assuring them that uh, we will run here 24 hours. Anybody who will come in the daytime, the police will be here. The patrol teams are not going for them to be called, but they will be here and monitoring. What we advise is that they should not take the law into their own hands. They should liaise with the district police commander to support the police in fighting crime. The regional police commander, however, warned against the firing of gunshots at night by some residents to ward off criminal insisting to divert the attention of the police patrols. From 11 p.m. in the night, they start firing. Before you realize, police are called to these scenes and eventually when they leave, particular areas, the criminals are at another point. So we advise that they should stop firing. When you are not under attack, there are rules in the use of weapons. So when they acquire them, they should get in touch with the police so that they will guide them as to how to use it. You don't shoot indiscriminately. Currently, a couple have given out the address making shop to be converted into a police post.